Hey everyone, nice to meet y'all. My name is Reyes. I am a painter, as you probably can see around me. Um, here I am. I we wanted to make this video kind of as an introduction, um, just to say hey, and to um, kind of just meet everybody and say what's up. Yeah, so I've been painting and, I mean, doing anything, any type of art that I can think of. Since I was a child, I've always been kind of um, Yeah, I just wanted to introduce myself and come in and kind of just open my doors up to everyone. Let everybody know that I'm doing it. And also, like, my triumphs, you know, what works for me, what doesn't work for me in terms of techniques, all the way to, like, the business side and finance of it. I do want to talk about just a like one of my favorite pieces. I do have a few, I do have a few pieces around here. Um, as you can see, um, this is a little part of a collection that I have, the blue guy down there, and these four right here. I've always loved how color can influence people, you know, like red. It's obviously used for a stop sign, but it grabs your attention and it's it invokes emotion of passion, of alertness, of, um, intensity, you know, and just how green invokes peace and serenity. I just wanted to kind of play a game with um, <clears throat> color and emotion with this collection. Oh, there's a little yellow one. I was standing in front of it. And that is inspired from a Francis Bacon painting. I'm sure you guys know exactly which one. Um, I actually took a picture of my face. Just like that. And then I just kind of tried to mimic it and then like put different colors so that one is my face just imagine <laughs> that was me doing that i will maybe i'll insert the camera roll picture here it's really gross but i don't know i probably won't um i do want to talk about this one it's one of my favorite pieces that i have all around the idea just came to me i saw it and i wanted to just put it down and as soon as i put it down it was exactly everything was placed how i wanted it like i added stuff and it was just like yes 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 you know as an artist i know that if, if you do create in any type of way sometimes um, when you do it a lot it's hard to it's hard to like love everything that you you make fully from start to finish you know that's very rare and this is really one of the only instances that i've had that it's a hundred percent i'm not like sitting there like what am i gonna do next fuck like or ooh, i think i messed it all up or maybe i should start over like usually we artists have that feeling if not 20 like 80 percent of the time every painting you know? i am going to just grab, grab it down so that way it's easier for me to like That's cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, this is gonna hurt me. Big ass forehead. Like, what would I click on? Oh, so this is um, a piece entitled. Oh, this is Texicali. It's Texicali. So, as you can see, um, it's a mix of Cali and Texas. Texicali. Yeah, I love Texas and I love cowboys. I love all things cowboy, space cowboy, alien versus cowboys. Um, <laughs> I mean, I just love cowboys. So, as you can see, uh, it's a little desert scene. Um, I wanted to do like like an abstract kind of world, I guess, but like re keep it realistic somewhat. So that's why I went with like the purple and you know I kept the sky 
that uh, like sunset color, but so yeah, I've always loved cactuses too. I mean, anything desert. Um, I grew up driving to Texas every year. So, you know, from going and visiting my grandparents in Arizona, they lived right next to the Superstition um, Mountains. It's the Superstition Mountains or Hills. Um, superstition something. So going over there, it was just beautiful, beautiful desert. I mean, like rocky views, like like these big things. Like you yeah. So down here, I have like a white picket fence. I wanted to do like a white wood fence because for me, when I think of like a fence in like America, I think of the American dream. You know, white picket fence. So I was just like, let me do white posts. So I did white posts. Um, and then I did some cactuses and connected them, obviously. You guys have eyes and can see that. Um, but I got the Texas Star. This little guy um, is supposed to represent the Alamo. Um, it's one of the building and then this flag as well, obviously, Texas flag. So yeah, Texas flag. We got star here, cactus, cactus. This is a surfboard. Surfboard. Um, I used to want to be a pro surfer. I got an armadillo right there, a little armadillo. He's great. I love cacti. And then we have, obviously, as you can see, our cowboy is not on a horse. He is on a penguin. He's on a flamingo. Um, I decided I wanted to not do horses and do flamingos because. brothers I don't really know what they're called um yeah so I mainly use oil paints I do use acrylics all of these back here are actually an acrylic um acrylic sometimes I mix them up but this one was all oil um super fun to it's I like oil because it's well, we won't get into the difference between oil and acrylic i feel like i could just so yeah um texicali this is not going to be the only one that i want to show you guys i really want to uh, kind of start making like in-depth videos on big pieces that i do so this youtube is going to be just a tool for me to tell my story to um, get my paintings out there and to share myself with the world because i believe that everybody has something very specific that they can give to the world and I believe that the world is waiting to hear it. So you can see all these guys, that one, literally everything, every painting in here, um, I have on my Instagram, so you guys can see them on my Instagram, at Reyes Morado, um, same way spelled here, R-E-Y-E-S-M-O-R-A-D-O, um, no underscore or anything like that, just Reyes Morado. I really appreciate the clicks on this video. If you watched it all the way through, great. If not, that's great too, as long as you did. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just want to thank you guys for your time. And so with that being said, I have been talking to myself for about an hour now. Um, so I need to go check on my gumbo. Which I should have done a long time ago. Um, yeah, hope you guys have a great day.